Our exciting vision at our College of Nursing is to think and do the impossible to transform healthcare and transform lives. The impact and the power of innovation in healthcare can drastically improve patient satisfaction, staff satisfaction, and really lift the profession of nursing to new heights. We are leading the way in so many different facets of evidence-based practice. We are doing things that nobody else is doing. Due to big dreams and a great strategic plan, our college has exploded from a total of about 1,200 students to 2,000 students now. So we are really moving and shaking the world. With the Buckeye Nurse Program, we actually go out into the community, uh, the local barber shop, uh, beauty shops, and give health talks and presentations, do health screenings for people. We have a full suite of academic programs here in the College of Nursing that range from traditional undergraduate, RN to BSN. We have multiple specialties at the master's level that lead to certification as a nurse practitioner or as a certified nurse midwife or a clinical nurse specialist. So we have two doctoral programs, a doctor of nursing practice and the PhD. We also have health coaching, healthcare innovation, and clinical research. Nurse scientists bring a focus or a lens on the research that keeps the patient and patient experience and response to illness at the center. So evidence-based practice is the integration of evidence, which is the current literature, the best science that's out and known. And so it's the integration of that body of knowledge combined with the expertise of clinicians. If you want to get steeped in evidence-based practice, because we know it leads to high quality, safe healthcare and better outcomes, then you want to come to the Ohio State University College of Nursing. The practice that you're providing to patients, the care you're providing, is based in science, not tradition or anecdote or the things we've always done. You also have to innovate. The Innovation Studio provides our students, faculty, and staff with the opportunity to get their ideas off the ground. Prosthetic devices can be an incredibly expensive component of life for particularly pediatric patients as they grow and may end up with a limb that needs, that's longer or shorter than it would need to be because of this ex extreme cost. Uh, with the beauty of 3D printing though, we could take their original file and just scale it as they grow. Mackenzie, you have normal heart sounds. Now we're gonna to listen to your lungs. So we're gonna have you take some deep breaths. Our students at a distance and our students on campus are having the opportunity to learn how to deliver care as a provider to patients who are at a distance through telehealth. Nurses often take great care of other people, but they don't do good self-care. This culture that we have makes healthy choices the easy choices for our students, faculty, and staff. We don't feel that it's good for students to be sitting all day through lectures and then asking them to go home and study. Every 30 minutes or so, I try to get my students up and moving. So whether that is dancing, whether it's running, whether that's doing jumping jacks. We teach our students how to live well. That's lead, innovate, vision, how to dream big, 